<laughs> don't have to worry about cross country lag. But going into this set, we got Mind and PK Chris. PK Chris, very good Nest player. Multiple like top eight runs in this tournament. No stranger to like deep bracket runs. But then we have Mind kind of in on a run today. I would say fresh off that, you know, upset over 8-bit man going into this set, I would say he has a lot of a lot of momentum. This is what Luigi really tells us ledge trapping. But can PK Chris escape? Oh, he does. Mind yeah, makes him actually, pay for it. Actually, the best case scenario, like sending Luigi off stage somehow <laughs> while getting ledge trapped. Like, oh, nice cyclone. Tornado. Yeah. yeah. When in doubt, yeah. cyclone. <laughs> Good DI for PK Chris, actually. Getting down thrown on the platform is usually a death sentence when you're fighting Luigi, but he DI'd away. Yeah. It was interesting that Mind was just willing to just, like, like basically float after him and be like, all right, let's see what you want to do. Oof, they capitalizes on that stock with big up smash. Yeah, that was a really good empty hop to up smash. Definitely threw PK Chris off. And uh, if I'm PK Chris, I would be very careful with approaching Luigi at zero. Nice use of that Cyclone again. Even when PK Chris feels like there's not a window to actually approach, there's the tornado right in his face. So far, PK Chris hasn't had a... Oh, wait. Hold on. Ooh, just barely whiffed the down smash there. It was unfortunate. Yeah, I was gonna say if you get Chris hasn't capitalized off again of these edge guards on Luigi like Ness normally does. Oh, nice snipe. He saved his jump though. Oh man. I'm playing very aggressive off stage. Big back throw, here. but Luigi still survived through it. Nice recovery. Oh, <laughs> I take back that comment. Just a little <laughs> too high. <laughs> yeah, it was nice, and then it wasn't. Gotta be careful on stage here. Even though he's at low percent, if he gets caught without a jump off stage against Ness, he can die incredibly early. And I think Pika Chris is looking for that opportunity. Yep, straight to the ledge. Not gonna waste the jump there. Good luck to keep in mind. Yeah. And the tornado dance did do it. Nope, not quite even on Smashville. Yeah, his use of the Cyclone's been pretty tricky. Like, he's not doing it at obvious times. I will say that PK Chris is kind of cycling through ledge options. If Mine starts to pick up on that, he's probably going to make him pay for it. Another back throw. Oh, he uses the PK Thunder, but it wasn't enough to gimp him. Oh, nice. Catch on the back dash. Another good up smash from Mind. Oh. Uh oh. Okay. This is trouble for PK Chris. Yeah. Oh, oh the he's there? Not, almost had the jump, but still off stage play here. Ooh, oh, deep, oh, just, deep forward air attempt, and it's oh, just not man. worth it. Not worth it. I, if it I hit, really, it was worth it. But. I really like that Mind went out there for that, but that was just so sad for a moment. Oh, the tornado? Not quite. Peter Chris is reeling. He's got to get back into this one. Oh. Dr. Oh, he just kicked the PK fire. It's good for him. Oh, that was so risky for... For PK Chris, he almost died. Yeah, mine's been doing really good at avoiding these ledge traps. Oh, parry, I've told. Yeah, might have been misinput. Parry up smash might have been enough. Or even an F smash, but it might have been too short, too slow to catch him. Really scary situation if you're PK Chris. Yeah, Not mine, out of this, though, because he can just get Luigi off stage. It's always a struggle. Oh, here we go. Okay, nice forward air to get out of that. The tornado has to do just it. Enough. Yeah, Oof. just barely enough to kill. Also, I kind of saw Pika Chris Diang up a little bit on that, unfortunately for him. But yeah, not, another good cyclone from from Mind to catch that. It's it's so rough because you know, often will like miss what move was being done right before a multi hit like uh, a multi hit kill confirm essentially like tornado uh, lands. So it's like oh you know if he was Diang up. It's like, oh, he might have already been holding up because that's where his movement was. So it's like, oh, he needed to switch off that. And that's just like one of those like those small things where it's like you, you pay for it, even though it's reasonable for why you wound up making that mistake, you know? Mm -hmm. Especially with multi hits too, when you're not sure which direction you're going to end up after the move ends. It's like really tricky to deal with that. I do like how mine's using the cyclone blow out a lot of these like uh, multi hit situations, like especially the PK fire. Yeah. Because a lot of Ness players, when they catch you in that move, they preemptively are going to try to do like a combo or something. 
and then uh, mine just immediately is out of it. Oh, here we go. I like I like this combo. Yeah, he's not going for the um, down air from the the throw, just because it's not as consistent. He's not. He's not giving PK a chance of a chance. PK Chris a chance to play this game. <laughs> oh, he oh, he's going for the ledge trump, and he missed it. Yeah, I hate when that happens. It happens to me like ninety percent of the time. Same. There it is the cyclone again. Out of the PK fire, I'm actually surprised that he's going for it as much at like that percent because mine's gotten the cyclone out every time pretty much. Great recovery. Oh. He's. Just, well, I think a part of it is that PK Chris is trying to like get started and hold some ground because mine's just been rolling him so far. Start here. Oh. And, and at least with PK fire, you can keep your opponent in front of you. Mm -hmm. PK Chris definitely doesn't want to drop the first stock again. Oh, drop oh, shield on the that's... dash attack, almost enough to kill. The snipe is going to go low. Yep, off the stage. Oh, the... oh and the up, he actually overpowered the down smash. Mm -hmm. Oh, caught the jump. for PK Chris. You go oh, deep. Nice. Oh, the deep hit of the... <laughs> that fair doesn't look that strong, but it absolutely was strong enough to take that stock. Well, well played by PK Chris right there. Yeah. That was so good. Good capitalization on Luigi's recovery. And uh, now he's on with the stock. Uh, but, yeah, that, just, that one just flat out killed. No, no DI will save you from that. It's Still just so hurt. unfortunate when like Luigi can pull out a, a, a kill basically from like uh, aerial drift, more or less. <laughs> Snap the jump again? Almost. I'm actually surprised PK Chris isn't just going for the down air. Oh no! Oh oh oh! oh. Oh, oh, it actually man. mattered. Him missing the tech actually mattered. That was like a ping ball pong uh, interaction. Ping ball. I don't know what I'm talking about. Ping ball interaction. Jesus. Yeah, rough, now, rough stuff for mine. Now it's up to mine to like keep his his cool and composure and try and bring this back. Because again, one of the things Luigi does have in this game is an insane comeback factor. Yeah. Good figure grab here. Oh, hey -oh. I can't believe he di that down throw up. Ugh. That's unfortunate for PK Chris. And now what was a huge lead is very, uh, very questionable. If he gets a grab, at least mine, that is. Actually, PK Chris using the platforms really well in this matchup yeah. right now. It's much more uh, feasible fighting Luigi when you can just play on the platforms and not have to worry about grab as much. That's the power of the counter pick here. Look at this, how defensively PK Chris is playing this right now. It's really really smart yeah Luigi can chase mm. you on the platform still though so you have to be careful but mine so far hasn't gone for it good Tech tech this time oh okay. wow mine was able to get back from that that was really impressive yeah great recovery I mean he needed it or else he was gone again oh side magnet but oh, he get missed the, the grab yeah kind of scary to play on the platforms up there Oh, no pivot grab. Off stage now. And here. Nair was, Nair was just oh. large enough. Oh, that's going to do it! <laughs> Whoa! What was the knockback on PK Thunder? <laughs> you know, I still don't understand that move because, like, sometimes I look at it and then the PK Thunder hits you and you get sent, like, off the stage, but then sometimes you get hit by it and then you literally just get directly above Ness and oh hit stun. God. So you're just, it's just combos. But. That was wild. <laughs> yeah. There was a lot there towards the end, but one of the like the thing that was the most important in that whole sequence was PK Chris's Nair having a large enough hitbox to avoid getting grabbed there, and that's what set Mind off stage in the first place. So yeah, he went for a pretty uh, risky pivot grab in my opinion because he just wanted to catch Ness's landing, but Ness's yeah. aerial drift is so good that it's not easy to get that. But. We're on Pokemon Stadium 2 for game three. Gotta say, I think this is one of Ness's like best neutral stages, and even sometimes counter picks, just because of how good he is on the platforms with the PK fire. Speaking of. And, yeah, and he also gets like, he gets the platform <laughs> aerial combos too. Yeah, he's not gonna hit that, but. He know. wanted style on this man. Yeah. <laughs> that, that won't work if you hit the uh, PK Thunder, like the tail of the hitbox of PK Thunder. But if they avoid it, um, you can get around that. I will it's say it's a lot of damage, though. Yeah, I mean, it might have been enough to rattle mine because so far PK Chris is starting to get the better of most of these exchanges so far. 
Yeah. It's almost like mine's chasing down PK Chris, you know? Yep. Yeah, uh, it, it's just kind of the same thing as Battlefield, the way he's using the platforms. Uh, Luigi has to kind of like chase Ness to get around that. And it's, yeah, Ooh. it's not it's not super, super safe. Again, trying to get the pivot grab on Ness's landing is not super easy to get that. Both players' ability to recover and get back to ledge against the other has been really, really cool so far. Big up air from PK Chris falls up with the PK Thunder. Pop mind up. The oh, PK this is fire so bad. there. Oh, it just lasted long enough for mine to stall oh. out. Oh man. Okay, luckily he doesn't get punished for miss it putting that side B as Luigi. He definitely wanted either a B or a Cyclone. Oh, no punish. Mine's avoiding getting hit by a really hard move, but he still needs to get a punch of his own. Like he's falling more and more behind as the match goes on. Oh no tech god. Either. Oh, that was such a like... well-placed PK Thunder 2, and everything's now just coming undone for mine. Oh, no! Oh! <laughs> oh, look at that. Chris, PK Chris is now just starting to engage and just like, I can just play defensively as I want. Come after yeah. me, Luigi. I mean, this is what you should do against a grappling character like Luigi. Big dash attack, though. Nice avoidance of the plunger oh, too. Yeah, what a great stall to get back on ledge. I'll do that. Yeah, very good movement right now for PK Chris. He's still alive from that. Oh, it's got to destroy mine right now. Stall, stall, stall. Oh, <laughs> it's still oh, hit him with the PK Thunder too. Yep. Uh oh. Nice magnet stall, but no immediate follow-up. Sometimes it's not about the immediate follow-up, but the one right afterwards, too. Oh, he almost got another PK fire. I think if that PK fire hit, he might have been able to get the kill off of it. Still, uh, mind, he's really far behind, but there's ah. the Cyclone on the neutral get up. He still needs a lot of work here. Even his, like, low percent combos, they've been a lot of damage, but not anything to lead to a kill. So he has to put in a, a super amount of work to bring this back. Oof, nice air dodge to avoid the back air, but oof, just gets brutalized by the oh. up air. And a PK Thunder catches him before he can land. Yeah, he can't even get a grab punch there. <laughs> that would have been it. That grab would have done it. <laughs> yeah, back throw at this percent the edge. Should kill. Wow, even catching the roll too. Big up air, and... Oh, man. Mine's very lucky he didn't get caught with the air dodge. But he... Oh, oh too I got much the rage. grab, but... Yep, too much rage for that combo. Finally gets a pair grab on landing, but dropping it. Oh, oh yeah, man. That's it, that's it. Yeah, that, that was that, rough. That last drop combo was symbolic of how that entire game three went for mind. PK Chris just dominant in 